A child is meant to learn, not to earn. A very good morning to one all present here. I am Shonal Yadav of class 8th here. Today we all are gathered here for the celebration of Anti-Child Labour Day. Anti-Child Labour Day is celebrated on 12th June every year since 2002. Child labour refers to the exploitation of children through any form of work that deprives children of their childhood interferes with their ability to attend regular school classes and is mentally, physically, socially and morally harmful. The significance of Anti-Child Labour Day is to pay attention to the problems of child labour and find a way to eradicate it. This day is used to spread awareness about the harmful, mental and physical problems faced by children forced into child labour. Nearly 1 in 10 children, which makes around 152 million children across the globe, are subjected to child labour, almost half of whom are his hardest form of work. To commence today's day, we have a Hindi poem on the same topic by Bhavika, Jenya Kashish of class 7b and Rajat Sharan of class 8c. Har varsh, har din, yu to anek divas manai jate hain. कविता, स्लोगन, पोस्टर, वीडियो बनाकर दिखाए जाते हैं। हम शिक्षित सभ्य समाज के लोग उन पर प्रतिक्रिया दिखाते हैं। लेकिन वास्तव में क्या हम उस समस्या के लिए कुछ भी कर पाते हैं? हम एक निशेध दिवस 12 जून को मनाते हैं। चर्चा, बातचीत, कानून इसके लिए पंते बनाते हैं। लेकिन वो बाल मजदूर आज भी है मजबूर। पेट की भूख दो वक्त के खाने के लिए वो बालक आज भी ठोकर खाता है नाम कोई नहीं जानता उसका छोटो ही बनकर रह जाता है विकार गालियां ठोकरों के धक्के खाकर नन्ना दिल सुबकता रोकर रह जाता है आंसू पीकर खुद को फिर मजबूत वो बनाता है उसकी सहायता के लिए कभी कोई आगे नहीं आता है आइए हम बाल मजदूरी के इस पाप को जड़ से मिटाने का संकल्प उठाएं। देखें कहीं जो किसी बाल मजदूर को सिर्फ पैसे या खाना न देकर उनकी मुश्किलें सुलझाएं। नियमों में बंधे इस समाज में बाल श्रमिक निषेध दिवस को कविता और पोस्टरों में ही ना मनाएं। करें कुछ प्रयास उनके उत्थान के लिए, उनको मिलकर इंसाफ दिलाएं। बाल मजदूरी को करके दो, उनकी स्थिति को मजबूत बनाएं, उनके हालात पर अफसोस जताना और झूठी आहें भरना अब बंद करें हम, अगर कुछ करना ही है तो बाल श्रमिक निशेध दिवस को साथ थक बना। छोटा ही सही प्रयास करें हम और बाल श्रमिक को श्रमिक से एक बालक बनाएं, लौटाएं उसकी पहचान, कोई उसे फिर छोटू ना बुलाए, आओ मिलकर उनका बचपन लौटाए। बाल श्रमिक ने शेष दिवस को पढ़े ना मनाना, ऐसा मिलकर कदम हमें है उठाना। आओ मिलकर संकल्प उठाएं, ऐसे कोई कदम मिलकर उठाएं। बाल मजदूरी को जड़ से मिटाएं। Indeed, that was a marvelous poem. Next we have a PPT by Avni Garg of Class 8B. Child labor is a major concern to be brought up by each state of India, but few states are still ignoring the decline in population of small kids. Even the poor children and their parents are borderless about their kids' health. There are many financial causes due to which children get engaged in hazardous activities. Good morning to one and all present here and I welcome you to this special assembly. So today, I, Avni girl from class 8B, Arvachan International School, I am here to tell you about child labor. Anti-Child Labour Day is celebrated on 12th June every year. The practice deprives children of their childhood and is harmful to their physical and mental development. Child labourers constitute a group of working children who are either too young to work or are engaged in hazardous activities that is potentially harmful to their physical, social and educational development. There is a famous saying, child is meant to learn not to earn. To 
risk one children living in poverty face a higher risk of death before age 5 malnutrition that stunts their growth being out of the school being forced into child labor or early marriage risk two these children are at heightened risk of death before age 5 stunted growth due to malnutrition being out of the school being forced to work risk three they are being denied education being forced into early marriage and giving birth before they are emotionally and physically ready child labor is found in factories where carpets and locks are made they are also found near furnaces they are also engaged in illegal activities for example smuggling they are found in terrorist activities begging which is the most common activity in india most forms of child labor are slavery and similar issues such as trafficking of children debt bondage and armed conflict Slavery is where one person is owned by and made to work for another person without having any say over what happened to them. They are also found in shops and small scale vendors in households in farm. The cures of poverty, lack of educational resources, social and economic backwardness, addiction disease or disability, law of cheap labor, family tradition, discrimination between boys and girls. general child burns and abuses like cuts and burns lack of schooling results in missing education qualifications and higher skills led to life in poverty competition of children with adults led to depressing wages and salaries the indian constitution ensures the right to all children from age 6 to 14 to free and compulsory education It prohibits forced labor, prohibits the employment of children below 14 years in hazardous occupation, and promotes policies protecting children from exploitation. Whoever employs a child or permits a child to work in punishable area for three months to one year, he or she has to pay fine no less than ten thousand to twenty thousand, or with both. Children employed in glass and firecracker industries. work not only for longer hours but also under hazardous conditions seriously compromising their health they are continuously exposed to toxic gases and substances leading to various skin and respiratory problems these are the bar graphs of 2011 census thank you and have a nice day thank you so much abhi for the wonderful ppt presentation last but not the least We have an English speech by Nisha Gupta of Class 8A. Hello all. I'm Nisha and today I'll be pouring some light on Child Labor Day. Every year Child Labor Day is held on 12th June. The main goal of this day is to draw attention and fight against child labor and the poor conditions they're working in. This helps in identifying the major problems and concerns and to lay guidelines to help the poor kids. even today millions of girls and boys are not getting proper education health and basic rights just because they're involved in work either because of poor condition of the family or by force many people are interested in hiring children as laborers as they're available at low wages as well as can be pressurized as kids won't retaliate much Maximum children have to face difficult conditions at work like hazardous environment, slavery, illegal activities like drug trafficking, prostitution and armed conflicts. All these conditions not only affect their childhood but force them to face trauma which cannot be removed from their mind as well as heart throughout their life. For selfish reasons, these employers destroy the life and dreams of these children. This day is important because it brings attention and concern on the previous mentioned problems and to find ways to eradicate them. This day spreads awareness about the harmful mental and physical problems faced by children forced into this kind of labor. The United Nations declared 2021 as International Year for the Elimination of Child Labor. Current global law includes the minimum age restriction, protection against forced forced labor, holiday time granted, 
conditions of working place, safety rules, and nighttime working conditions. Some law states that a person under 18 cannot work in a condition in which they have to compromise with safety, health, or morals. Children aged 13 to 15 may perform light work, but that does not harm or hinder their education. Children under 13 are restricted from working. With the help of awareness campaigns, a decrease has been in the number of child laborers between the years 2002 to 2012. The International Labour Organization estimated that about 115 million children aged 5 to 17 work in dangerous conditions and some 22,000 children lose their lives every year worldwide due to workplace hazards. Therefore, we all should be aware of this social evil by doing whatever little bit we can and say no to child labor so that these children can say yes to life. What a wonderful speech. It is rightly said that children are like wet cement. Whatever falls on them makes an impression. The harsh impact of child labor at such a tender age can give such setbacks to the child which are irreversible and a major threat to the future. As an responsible and aware citizen of this country, it's our duty and responsibility to generate awareness in order to stop the civil practice. Now I would like to request everyone to stand up for the national anthem as we conclude this assembly. Thank you for being with us. <laughs> Punjab, Sindh, Gujarat, Maratha, Dravida, Uttala, Vanga, Vindya, Himachal, Yamuna, Ganga, Uchala, Jaladhi, Taranga, Tava, Shubha, Name, Jage, Tava, Shubha, Ashish, Mage, Gahe Tava Jaya Gatha Jana Gana Mangala Dayaka Jaya He Bharat Bhagya Vidhata Jaya He Jaya He Jaya He Jaya 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 He